Have you ever paused to consider how a split-second decision could change your life forever? Welcome to a discussion that could save lives, maybe even yours. Today, we delve into the world of industrial safety, specifically focusing on the concept known as the line of fire. Picture this. It's a cool morning in April, back in 2017, in a bustling shipyard. Workers are hustling, machines are whirring, and amidst this orchestrated chaos, one man named John makes a decision that changes his life. John, an experienced crane operator, is moving a heavy load when suddenly the alarm signals a malfunction. In the heat of the moment, John decides to manually override the system, stepping directly into the line of fire. The line of fire isn't a physical line drawn on the ground, but an invisible hazard zone. It's the path an object or substance could take if something were to go wrong, putting anyone in its path at immediate risk. In John's case, the line of fire was the trajectory of the heavy load he was moving. Can you guess what happened next? The crane's cable snapped and the load swung uncontrollably. John, standing in the line of fire, was struck. Thankfully, he survived, but with significant injuries that kept him out of work for several months. John's story is not unique. Every day, industrial workers step into the line of fire, often without even realizing it. The key to avoiding such incidents lies in understanding and respecting the line of fire. Think about it. If John had stayed clear of the crane's trajectory, he would have avoided the accident. So, remember these key points. The line of fire is a potential path of danger. Always be aware of your surroundings and make safety your priority. When an alarm goes off, heed it. It's there for a reason. And finally, never underestimate a situation. Even a momentary lapse in judgment can have severe consequences. John learned this lesson the hard way. But we can learn from his experience. Stay safe, stay alert, and always respect the line of fire. Remember, safety isn't just a protocol. It's a way of life. Thank you for joining in today's discussion on industrial safety. Be sure to share this knowledge with others. Because when it comes to safety, we're all in this together.